This is the title poem of my first collection. Uh, I want to write a poem about Indians coming to Britain. Um, and I want to kind of almost uh, capture a very old English kind of feel to the poem. And Because I, I, I partly imagine the, the English language itself being an immigrant language and the way it goes abroad and brings words back. So I want to capture that feel. And I've got a quote from Matthew Arnold's Dover Beach. It's my little epigraph to the poem, uh, which is so various, so beautiful, so new. So it's called, Look, We Have Coming to Dover. Stowed in the sea to invade the alfresco lash of a diesel breeze, ratcheting speed into the tide. Brunt with gobfuls of surf, flemmed by cushy come-and-go tourists, proud on the cruisers, lording the ministered waves. Seagull and shoal life, vexing their blarneys, Upon our huddled camouflage, past the vast crumble of scummed cliffs, scramming on mulch, as thunder and bladders, yobbish rain and wind, on our escape, hutched in a Bedford van. Seasons or years we reap inland, unclocked by the national eye, or stabs in the back, teamed for breathing sweeps of grass through the whistling asthma of parks, burdened, ennobled, polling sparks across pylon and pylon. Swarms of us grafting in the black, within shot of the moon's spotlight, banking on the miracle of sun to span its rainbow, passport us to life. Only then can it be human to hoik ourselves, barefaced for the clear. Imagine my love and I, and our sundry others, blared in the cash of our beeswaxed cars, our crash clothes, free. We raise our charged glasses over unparasol tables east, babbling our lingos, flecked by the chalk of Britannia.